guys, Amanda Nelson here. I'm back with another edition of Read It Like It's Hot. Usually these videos are about a book coming out this week that we think you should read, but I'm going to tell you a book that came out a little bit longer ago than that. It came out on July 5th, so I'm a week or two late, but that's fine. I still think you should read it right now. And that is Transmigration of Bodies by Yuri Herrera, translated by Lisa Dillman, and this is from And Other Stories. I really love uh, Yuri Herrera. His book last year, uh, Signs Preceding the End of the World, was one of my favorite reads of the year. It was also the winner of the Best Translated Book Award, which was an award that I was a judge for, and I fought really hard for that book, um, and it won, and I was really happy about that. And this is his newest to be translated into English, and it's a Mexican noir crime novella with a twist. <laughs> so the book follows a man named the Redeemer. Um, you never find out his actual name. You never really find out anyone's actual name. They, all, you know, it's a crime underbelly of Mexico and so everyone has nicknames like the Neanderthal and the Redeemer and Baby Girl and things like that. Uh, except one woman's name is Vicky, so you, you get Vicky. The Redeemer is kind of a fixer. He works for one crime family, um, you know, fixing their problems. He used to be a lawyer then he got caught up uh, somehow in this whole world of crime and violence and now this is sort of what he does for a living. And he gets stuck in the middle of two crime families, the one that he works for and their like you know, Capulets to the Montagues, the crime family that they are most embattled with. Both of the families lose a child and blame the other, and so the Redeemer has to kind of mitigate that feud and try and keep the situation under control. And all the while, this is set against the backdrop of a plague that is sweeping through Mexico, um, like a mosquito airborne virus that is killing people off. So it's noir, really like kind of old school gangster fiction, against the backdrop of the apocalypse, which is really interesting and uh, something that I've never read before. And of course his writing is amazing. The translation is really, really great. It's a not thinly veiled statement about violence and crime in Mexico, uh, which I don't know a lot about. And I have now gone down this rabbit hole of reading about um, that situation in Mexico because of this little book, it's so small. Uh, but that's, I think what one of Yuri Herrera's really big draws is that he can take these like issues and write something about them that isn't preachy but is just doing the thing that authors do which is exploring his the world around him and the things that affect him in his life so that's the transmigration of bodies by yuri herrera go read it as if it were hot because it is